Hi guys, this is Dee with My Walk is Real. I'm coming to you today with the 2020 January 27th through February 2nd spread. Today I'll be using the undated Truly Yours Planner by Naptime Alternative. So let's get started. This is the January monthly spread where I write down all of my different things that's going on and then I transfer them to my weeklies. Here's the first week of January. Just doing a little flip through to see the previous weeks. I didn't get to do, get to do a plan with me for all of them, but here they are. When I do it, I like to plan with for church, home, and work. Top level is my home, middle level is church, and the bottom is work. So let's get started. I've started by creating a separate notebook where I've placed different sticker sets that I have just so that it'd be simple for me to add them to my weekly spread. I think that's called in the planner world shopping my stash, my digital stash. So off camera, I use the double word black and gray letters from Naptime Alternative and half boxes watercolor strokes by Plannerology Studio. Here, I'm taking the monthly and daily wording from Naptime Alternative, which is her Born Ready script, and I'm using that to place my dates on my weekly calendar. I'm not sure if I mentioned, in the left-hand corner, upper corner, I have a small mini calendar 2020 that came from Boho Berry. I use that to denote which week of the month I'm in. I'll continue to speed through this process and continue putting my dates at the top of my spread. I like this spread layout because I'm able to separate my home items from my church items and my work items so that it's just a clear, concise area where I know what's going on at what section of my life. This is where I got the inspiration for my colors for this spread. This was a freebie that I got from Planner One Love. It's their Color Me Marble sticker set. It's made for, I believe, Erin Kydren or either a Happy Planner, but you'll see how I manipulate it and use it in my digital spread. I've decided to use these three half boxes at the bottom so for my headers, which I will write home, church, and work on and then copy and paste them to the different heading se header sections for the week. Here I'm just sizing it down so it'll fit my box. I really like that color. This is coming together okay, slowly but surely. We getting it, we getting it. I repeat this process, cropping down each box for each different heading se section. And then we'll just copy and paste this to each day. Now that we have the heading sections down, before I copy and paste, I'll get this words, which is the Born Ready font again from Naptime Alternative, and I'll try and find the words that I need to put in my heading sections. Thank you. 
Okay, let's see which words we have. I see work. We'll definitely need that. So let's do a freehand crop of that, size it down, and place it in the work section. That's the church section. I know I will move it eventually. My next dilemma is there's no church wording or home wording. But it's not a problem for me. We'll just use the text tool to create the words that we need. So what I'll do, I'll try and find a font that is similar to the one I've already used for my work section, which may find itself to be difficult, but I'll just use three different fonts. So it looks like that's what I meant to do. That's what we do. Now that I have my font selected, I'll type in church, size it down. I really like that one. We'll find a font for the home section and do the same thing. Now that we have our headers created, we'll just copy and paste to each section. Make sure under lasso tool, you have only the text tool and the image tool selected so that you can grab both items at the same time. Okay, almost done. Here I am at my work section. I work Monday through Friday. However, this week being Super Bowl Sunday, I've picked up some extra shifts on the weekend because I know others want to watch the game. It's a tedious task, but one that's needed. Okay, next I'm going to get some icons that I got from Posh Plum Plans, and I got this off of Etsy. Just looking to see which items I have and then I will freehand crop them and place them in their respectable places. I have the recycle uh, icon here. I don't take out the trash, my husband does, but we can always remind him. And if I'm reminded, he's reminded. Game time, this is Super Bowl Sunday weekend, go Chiefs. I am from Kansas City, so I'm very proud of our team. Let's see, which other icons did I use? Bible study. We have Bible study at my church on Wednesdays. We have two ser services, one at 10 o'clock in the morning for people that work at night and one at 630 at, in the evening for us that work in the morning. At the time of me planning this, it is Wednesday, so I'm writing this planner, putting, placing this planner time sticker here. I can't get my words right. Just searching, trying to figure out what will I use, what have I used, what haven't I used. I like icons on my weeklies just to let me see a picture and wording. And I love the font that they use on here. All right, Posh Plum Plans. I see this work icon. I'll take that and place it at the bottom. And then a little bit later, you'll see how I'll use this icon. I like to keep track of all of my hours work just to make sure no one's trying to cheat me. If I use the work icon, you know I have to write the payday. Yes, we love that day.
along with payday comes bills so here I will use this bill pay icon and just write in the bills that I have due and on which days Debbie Downer gotta pay bills <laughs> now it's decorating time i love these full boxes i will take these full boxes and place those in the days that i don't have a lot going on choose joy i choose that every day and my joy comes from the lord thank you god i just continue taking the full boxes and placing them where i see fit so you'll see here i decide to take the choose joy stick full box and place it under the church heading and then place the flower one up in my home heading i did this because i had a meeting at south kansas city on monday so that was needed to be put up there so i have room at the top to place that meeting now i'm using a black ribbon just to place it up there and put my meeting on there i love this rose gold so I will use this full box, place it under Tuesday, and then I'll take a half box, place that on top of it to denote a meeting I had at church, Needless Bruises. If you're interested in knowing what Needless Bruises is, just comment below. Using this meal sticker, I will turn it around and put my work icon on top of it so that I can write down my hours for the week. Making sure we have our lasso tools selected for images. We'll just take that, copy and paste it Monday through Sunday. back to decorating taking more of these full boxes and placing those in the spots where I know I don't have a lot going on so that way my spread is just appealing to the eye I place these down in the work section and then I'll come back and crop them because what's going to end up happening is I will have to crop them to the size go back and relayer the work sticker for my hours that I recent that I just placed I'm waiting for good notes to update this layering process but so I'm just going ahead and just going to put each picture that I decide to use down in the boxes. Now that I have the full boxes that I plan on using, I'll go in individually, crop them, and place them to size in each section. I'm going to do them all at one time because, like I said, I have to go back in and relayer the work, um, the work hour sticker that I have at the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead, get them all to the size that I want, then go back in and relayer so that nothing's covering up my strip at the bottom. They have this cute weekend banner. I'm going to place this at the top. Now I'm taking this tracker box, which I don't use for tracking, but I love the image on there. I cropped it down, taking away the tracking marks, and I will use that to put prayer. Because we do prayer at 6 o'clock before Bible study starts at 6.30. I have this um, cute freebie that I got from Creative, Creative Chic. And I just thought this babe really looked so cute. So I had to use her. And then I used some of the different elements that came in this um, set. I believe it was like a March 2018 freebie. 
I've placed a pale full box under the church heading and just put this quote sticker there. And I'll place a few more around just to take up space. The sleigh and flawless will be used to hit, do the headers for my slap for my sidebar. Uh, get your words right, D. That is my my walk is real logo, which I created and procreate on my own. I'm so proud of myself with that. Here, I'm just using the heart checklist that came with the Color Me Marble set, and I will take those and stretch them to size under my flawless and slay sidebar headings. That I just use for writing notes and quick memos or lists that I need to write. I continue decorating. I will reuse some of the full boxes that I've previously used, but I'll just crop them out, crop them down so that they look like different boxes. Ain't I smart? There I go. My walk is real logo. I'm gonna play that looks good on there. And then my post to social media. Because I try and post if I don't make a video, I still like to post the picture of my final weekly views, monthly views, just so you guys can get an idea of what's going on with me. I just realized how many elephants are in this set. I love it. My mother-in-law would really love it. That is her animal. She has elephant everything. You want to make her happy? Get her something with an elephant on there. Here I'm taking this marble box. I'm going to fill it. And then I have another planter chick that I'm going to place in there. I use this half box just to place the game time sticker on top for a backing. There's my bohemian chic 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 chick that was another creatively chic freebie and then finishing touchings we'll just place this flower there to fill the box and voila we're done here you go the finished view of my january 27th to february 2nd view hope you enjoyed don't forget to like comment and subscribe let me know what you guys would like to see more on my channel. Have a good day. Bye-bye.